Hi friends, welcome to this channel. Um, this is part 2 of user registration application. In this video, we'll discuss how to customize this front-end application. Um, I want to change the background color of this application. So for that, um, um, open index.html file here inside body tag. I add style attribute with a background color. So save the modification. Um, under C here, selector root app root root com uh, sorry root component of angular application is app component this one and the corresponding html will be app component dot html here instead of um, this default html code we need a div with class container hit enter Inside this will show shine up component HTML. For that, we copy this selector and pasting here. Um, save all the modification and uh, go back to the browser here. Here you can see the background color and uh, text sign up works. Okay. Um, Instead of this sign up works text, we have to show user registration form. Let's look how we can do that. Here we have the styles global style sheet file. Um, inside this, inside this uh, styles file, um, I want to paste some predefined styles to this application. Okay. save this application and uh, go to sign up component html here we will create a form for user registration before that in sign up component we have to define a property on um, user it's of the type user it's of the type user model you can see here that um, user model class is imported here in Anglo 6 it's working like this next uh, in a uh, sign up component um, remove this code we need a div with class row hit and tab uh, inside this we need a div with class call s8 this is like a call md8 in bootstrap to add offset of two columns from left and right use the offset class hyphen s2 hit tab inside this do i want to add code from the front end framework here we are using materialize uh, css as front end framework here select chords here you can see here chords uh, it's have header below the contents are displaying inside the content we will uh, display our user registration form so let's look how we can design the code here Yeah, we need a div with um, class card hit tab inside that we want to show a header for form title for that do sm jumbotron this is a custom class which we have defined in our styles file another class um, framework center icon align hit tab Inside this div, I need a h2 tag. Here we have to display the header text user registration. Save the changes and go back to the browser. Here we have the header for this form user registration. 
below this um, we want to show form for user registration for that of below this form header we need a form with a class call s12 we need a background color white hit tab we don't need this action attribute so let's remove it and i want to design this form um, similar to this here forms our form almost looks like this in order to design this form we need a div with class row hit tab here we have to set the local reference for this form as user registration equals inside this div it's like a single line we want to split the row into two columns so we can add um yeah div with plus um input field with call yes six hit tab like this we need one more div so copy this one and paste it below that inside this div um, we want to show you username for that uh, use input field hit tab here we need a name attribute username then local reference username which is of type um, ng model then uh, we need two way data binding ng model here we have to assign this user user dot user name which is from user model class okay after this input field we need a label you label text will be username like this we can add text box for password so copy this one and replace this username text box with a password in appropriate places okay like this we can add label text or uh, text box for rest of the properties uh, which is from users model class email first name last name like that after this we need a save button sorry submit button button type will be submit button text also submit okay then to work with form element we have to import forms module inside this uh, app folder sorry app module here paste the import statement of forms module and make this forms module as part of import sorry
then uh, save all the modifications uh, and go back to the browser okay here we have created user registration form in anglo 6 application with materialized css in our next video we'll discuss um, how to sorry how to set mandatory field for this application and validations error like that um, thank you for watching this one